He's talking about one of the greatest miracles he has ever done for his people. He's discussing the parting of the Red Sea. And the very next verse, he says, forget about it. <laughs> oh, Lord. Help me. The very next verse, he says, forget about that. It is nothing compared to what I am going to do. <laughs> Forget about it. Woo. We have been guilty of celebrating what God did 10 years ago and 15 years ago and six months ago and getting stuck in the yesterday moment. And he says, quit worshiping those moments. I've got something bigger for you if I could ever get you to look forward and speak to tomorrow, speak to the next day. Quit looking back. It was something I did, but forget about it. living on the prayer meeting you had 15 years ago that was so wonderful what a great moment but it's time to quit looking back and look forward because when you learn how to forget it doesn't mean you're not thankful for it or grateful for it it just means you're not worshiping it any longer because you know there's a greater thing about to happen if I just position myself to look to right now and to tomorrow Forget about it! Woo! There's an opportunity for life-changing understanding. When the people of God get up in the morning and look at their day and say, this is the day the Lord has made. I'm rejoicing in this and being glad in it. And I speak to what's going to happen today. The day doesn't happen to me. I happen to the day. <laughs> 